my name is Alok Shrivastava and I welcome you again to Network Nuts and I personally give a, a big thank to all of you for the kind of response I'm getting for these small videos and thank you once again for clicking on the YouTube so in this small video I'm going to show you how to create a shell script for taking a time bound input as you can see here the objective is for time bound input I had a small script here for you I will just open it it is it I had created a script here the idea behind the whole video is not to show you this particular script but the idea is to give you the idea behind the idea I hope it's clear so here I'm just uh, explaining you the basic steps uh, shebang will obviously be there the author name and the objective is that taking the time bound input I had specified a variable here it can be any name here I had specified as timeout limit 4 so it is 4 seconds of wait it means if after executing the script and the script will ask you to enter something if you don't enter anything for 4 seconds the script will automatically exit cleanly so my script will echo you type something and then it it will wait I am taking the input from the keyboard by the read and I specified the timeout as the dollar timeout so the dollar timeout will automatically take the value from my variable and the output or whatever I am feeding here will be going in a variable named say first it can be anything and I am putting it in the background and then a blank line space if dollar z first means if nothing is there then it will tell you or will echo you sorry timed out or any message that you want to display otherwise if you have typed something within the four seconds of limit you will be given back your particular input and after then my ex my command will or my script will exit cleanly so the basic thing is that the whole crux lies here these three lines specify a timeout limit put it in a variable and then force that timeout with the read command by this syntax so, so that's the crux now it is solely up to you where how and how efficiently you can deploy these small tricks in your customized shell scripts let's execute it I save out and I give exit timeout so here I'm not typing anything as I had not typed in for four seconds I will be given a message sorry timed out now again I type say alok so it will give me you typed alok that's beautiful it's very small thing but very good and it and the script is very useful uh, while taking inputs or the passwords those are sensitive so I hope you like this small idea and see you again with more tips and tricks those are not found anywhere within the course limit or the prescribed courseware thank you very much god bless